Lazarus Chakwera, Malawi's new leader, spent time talking about good governance and uniting the nation in his inaugural speech. The former Pentecostal preacher said he knows some people didn't want him as their president. His swearing-in came after months of protests against last year's disputed election that left the country bitterly divided. The new president asked Malawians to give him a chance to earn their trust. With your help, we will restore a new generation's faith in the possibility of having a government that serves. Not a government that rules, a government that inspires, not a government that infuriates, a government that listens, not a government that shouts, a government that fights for you and not against you. That would mean trying to work with his political rivals, supporters of former president Peter Mutarika, who's criticized the presidential rerun, saying Malawi's electoral commission, known as the MEC, made a mistake. These are perhaps the worst elections that we've held in the history of Malawi. And we believe the MEC needs to ensure that it upholds the principles of having quality elections in Malawi. Otherwise, we're setting a very, very bad precedent for future elections in Malawi. Chakwera is promising to tackle corruption, poverty, and create much needed jobs in one of the poorest countries in the world. Most of Malawi's budget comes from foreign aid. The greatest challenge now is how do we set things right? How do we reboot Malawi? And uh, this is a, a task that is huge. Great promises were made by the politicians and now it is up to them to achieve those promises or else pay the price at the next elections. Freedom is coming to work. It's the first time in Africa a court-ordered election has led to victory for an opposition candidate. Over the decades, the continent has sometimes had a turbulent history with democracy. Some leaders have stayed in office for much longer than their mandates required. People are closely watching Chakwera, who is promising a new start for Malawians. But can he deliver? Harumatasa, Al Jazeera.